Hey everyone, Zeno picking back up here where we left off uh, in the Dragon Man Reignited demo. Um, I'm just gonna get straight back into it. Two stages left, Tremble Woman and Curtain Man. Um, let's do Curtain Man first, why not? Okay, I like how this guy just kind of looks like a, a trash can or something with big heels. It's funny. Okay, let's see. Okay, I'm getting big-time Charade Man vibes from this. Let's see how this goes. I'm not sure how I feel about this color palette so far. Something about it, uh, just doesn't look... Looks a bit weird. Uh, and that was fake. Okay. I kind of thought that was a platform. Should have known better. I mean, in my defense, it kind of looks like it, so not sure. I mean, this thing in the foreground is, uh, you can pass through it, and it, it looks like a solid, so I don't know. Yeah, I, this is really misleading, actually, because it would be a good idea to jump down here to fight the uh, Joe, but you can't. Okay, so... Oh, okay, this is see-through, I see. And you can just barely jump over that attack. I guess that's fine. Could maybe uh, be changed to be a little less confusing, but... Not a big deal. Uh... Up? Okay, wait, what is this? Okay, just standard uh, tornado batteries. Okay, um, I guess you're just supposed to dash. Okay, that was pretty precise. Another trick there. Nice try. Whoa! Okay. Okay, that was funny. Okay. Yeah, that that's fine. That's cool. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. I should have been looking out for that. Oh, and the uh, tornado battery uh, moves uh, up and down, too. Okay, that's cool. Very neat. Oh, huh, that's clever. If you look uh, to the right, you can see this mask is happy, so it's uh, the, the enemy. Okay, that's good that you can distinguish between them. Oh, some pickups? Okay, nice. Okay, I was going to... Uh, yeah, I, I like that mask enemy. That's nicely done. Okay, except, uh, what am I looking at right now? Health? Um... Oh, okay, that's a ladder. It's a bit hard to tell what that is, uh, in the diamond there, but that's a ladder. Oh, and that's a life. Okay, wait, wait. How do you get that? In the world? Is there a ladder here? Um... Just try to M coil up to it. And that didn't work. That didn't work either. How are you supposed to get this? What? Slide? No. Uh oh wait. Uh is this destructible? No. Okay, well I'm a little confused. Okay, wait, what is this V-Trail? Oh. Um... That's just, uh... The Force Beam weapon from Magma Level 2. Okay. That's cool. I, I like that. Oh, and, uh... Swordman, uh, Castle. Or, uh, Blade Man. Blade Man Castle. Except... Okay, you know what? Oh, that freezes. Oh, okay, that killed it really quick. That's a good weakness. If intentional, that was good. The microphone is getting messed up. <clears throat> so this one's not gonna come to life? 
This one on the right? Guess not. Uh... Okay. It's pretty good. The use of tornado batteries is a lot less terrible than in the original Tornado Man stage. Wait, what? Ah, there- Oh, shoot, there's two of them. I saw the one in the far right, not the one in the middle. That, uh, attack is kinda tough to jump over. There we go. That was a pretty cool trick shot. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Ah, I catapulted myself. Damn it. Okay. okay, you can't go that way for some reason. The Both sides of the screen look the exact same, but you can only go to the right. Interesting. These, uh, ball-throwing Joes have a bit too much health, in my opinion. They have, like, 10 health, and, uh, it kind of feels like all they do is waste your time. Oh, god damn it. Um, now I'm not saying to, uh, make their health, like, 3 or something, but, like, I don't know, 7? Uh, having, like, 10 health is kind of excessive. But let's, let's do a count, just to be sure, but, uh, I think that's a little... A little excessive. Okay, like... Oh, just despawned, okay. Okay, one... Two, three, four... Five, six, seven... Eight, nine... Ten. Okay, yeah. That does too much. Make it, like, seven. Or six. Ten, uh... I'd... So what's even the point? Just to make you uh, hurt your fingers? Ah, uh, man. Uh, this is what happens when you get impatient. <clears throat> oh, and I panicked. I wonder if there's a rush jet uh, in the game or met jet. Seems like, uh, there were some parts that were designed for it or something, so maybe we'll be seeing that. Alright, try not to flub this screen. There we go. Okay, sweet. Yeah, I knew that was coming. Oh, that explodes, too. I like this ladder graphic. Weird thing to point out, maybe, but I like this ladder graphic. This color scheme is also growing on me a bit, especially, uh, adding the pink made it look a lot better, I think. The dark purple works fine as, like, a background color. Oh! Oh, I almost screwed myself! Ugh. Oh my god, that was close. Twice. Holy. Yeah. Okay, what's the pattern? Oh, I see that. I see that mask in the, uh, bottom left corner. I, I see that. You're not drinking me. Yeah. Very funny. Get out of my sight. Okay. 
Very funny. Very, very good trick. But you're not fooling me. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I did not expect the screen to scroll like that. Ah. I shouldn't have even jumped there. I would have been fine. I like this music, by the way. It's, uh... Again, uh, gives me big-time charade man vibes. Wait, that mask didn't even activate! What's up with that? That enemy, uh, never even, uh, woke up. Bizarre. And, uh, I don't know how I missed that. Okay. Man, if I was actually good at this game, the recording could be over in, uh, like 50 minutes instead of 30. But, you know. It takes too much, uh... I'm really, uh, confused by this mask that never activates in the bottom left. Is it just there just to trick you? And again, I made the same mistake. You know, some, like, lines, some uh, graphics to show where the batteries can go might be useful? Um... Because here, the battery goes almost to the edge of the screen, um, and then it ends right before this platform, but I don't know I kind of logically expect it to hit the platform like it just did So on this screen it hits the platform on this side and then stops one block short on the other If you're not gonna have any uh, consistent um, Logic about where the battery goes maybe consider uh, putting a line Just like a one pixel thin graphic uh, might be useful because to me, there's no reason why the battery would stop one block before this wall or before that ledge. I just don't really get it. Now, I'm also bad, but uh, still. Oh, what the heck? That still follows you? I see that mask. And uh, it also didn't activate again. Can you reach these? Oh. Okay, I guess you can. Okay, I guess I'll bite. Get some ammo back. Let's see if either of these weapons are, uh, weakness of Curtain Man. Oh, night beloved, save me from the evil dragon. <laughs> okay, yeah, that's, that's funny. Uh, dragon. You know I'm here, right? Magic of theater. Pretty cliche. Okay, yes. Just a friendly competition. Okay. Alright, let's see how this goes. Oh, okay, he's a shield. Okay, the shield robot master. Interesting. I would not have expected that, but... Wait. Is this guy just plant man? Is this just plant man? Okay, yeah, this... This is plant man, but he double- he double jumps sometimes. And, uh, we don't have the weakness somehow. Can you shoot through the shield? I think you can literally shoot through his shield, too. Okay. You might want to check the hitbox on that. Um, something about that doesn't seem quite right. <laughs> but, uh, looks like the weakness is the one weapon we don't have. Either that, or, uh, not all the weaknesses are programmed. Alright, let's see. Let's see if we can beat- Okay, you can literally shoot through his shield. Um, I would consider changing that. Maybe. Because, uh, 
What good is a shield that doesn't protect you? Okay, yeah, literally, the shield does nothing for this poor guy. Okay, well, if you play this demo and you're watching this video, uh, now you know which stage to go after first. Okay, um... I'm not sure what to say. Uh, that boss fight was pretty underwhelming. Not gonna lie. Um... And we get to hear the glitchy weapon get music, which... Curtain Call is the name. Okay. I gotta admit, that's clever. Can we select any of these? Okay. Yeah. Okay, Shaw. Still don't have enough for anything. That's really good. Alright, let's fight, uh... Concrete Man and Bright Man had a child. Let's do it. Oh, cool, the Mega Man 4 train. Okay, now this is cool. What is this? Okay, I thought that was a background element. Um... Okay, not gonna lie, this really does not look like a spike to me. It, it kind of looks like a piece of coral or something. Um... Yeah, maybe... Maybe that could use... Uh, a bit of an improvement. These pickle men look really good, though. They, uh, the sprite looks a lot better. Interesting. Maybe it has better shading. Oh, okay, cool. That's actually a good use of the, uh, Pluto platforms. Why did these guys throw their hammers so high? Oh, whoa. Okay, wait. I know in the original Mega Man 5 Game Boy, those platforms start shaking when you're at the same uh, X coordinate as them, but for platforms you're supposed to step on to cross, maybe don't have them start falling before you actually touch them. If you get in the air near them, you, as you just saw, they'll start falling anyways, but if you're supposed to cross on them, maybe consider tweaking the uh, AI to not drop until you step on them. Have like a variant. Like, you know, two different types of platforms. Because, uh, not sure. Just, uh, falling to your death because you were in the, the air above the platform doesn't make much sense to me. Um, like, here it makes sense, because the obstacle is it, it falls on top of you. But when it's below you, that doesn't make so much sense anymore. Just some food for thought. Um, also those spikes on the bottom are a lot more clear about the fact that they're spikes. Like, these, down here, are clearly spikes. Uh, this to the left, not sure, um... At first, I did not think that was a spike. Oh, these have the, uh, Gutsman shaking effect. Interesting. Might have to blow my nose. Anyways, as I was saying... Oh, actually, let's test out the uh, new weapon. Okay, let's see. Curtain Call? Interesting, uh... Kind of plain, uh, graphic. Alright, let's see. Oh. Shield? Um, okay. So it's just draining energy as you hold it. You can't even fire it or anything, so... Um, not sure. Maybe it's like, a uh, Flame Mixer? Let might try it against something if I get the chance. Mini boss? Ooh. Oh, okay, this is cool. Okay, wait. Why does it only uh, sometimes spawn a shockwave thing? Okay, that was a cool idea for a mini boss. Little one of those uh, wily four gutsmen thing. That's pretty cool. Okay, wait, how do we get to this NPC? Okay, uh, I guess that's not it. Oh, okay, there we go. You can slide through. Okay, what's up? Where is this train headed? Uh, okay. It, it's cool flavor text, I guess. I was kind of expecting, like, something, but that's, that's fine. Whoa. 
Uh, I like how the platform killed the enemy. Was not expecting that. Pretty cool. Oh, whoa. Okay, that was tricky. Oh, okay, look. That's like a classic example. I just got near the platform. I don't even think I touched it, and it still fell. And, uh, if I didn't have a coil, I'd be screwed here. Alright, let's go. Yeah, it, it happened again. When you're when you're above the platform, it decides to, to give out. And, um, okay, freeze. I was getting on my nerves. Alright, nice. A weapon tank? Not that we're gonna... Oh, whoa. Nice. Save the run. Alright. Where are you supposed to go here? Down? Um... Oh, maybe through, because the door is open? Okay. I wonder if he can get up there. Alright, another cool mini boss that fine by me. Oh, is this the boss gate? Alright. Oh, uh, helpful met, okay. That's also a plagiarism of uh, Medi from Starman 2, but uh, I'll let that slide. Alright. Well, hello there. Hi. Not much of a conversationalist, so might this be your train? Yes. Good luck. Oh, okay. Alright, straight to the point, alright. Well, that's fine by me. Okay, let's see, do we have a weakness? Curtain call. Okay, no, that didn't work at all. Ice? No. Force beam! Oh yeah, that works. Okay. Okay, so what's the pattern? Jump and uh... Okay, wait. So she's like Conra man. Er, no. Uh, the bullet man. Dangan man. Okay. Yeah, she's like a modified Dangan man. Okay. Not bad. Decent pattern. Uh, didn't want to stick around to find out that much more, but... Alright, you got... Quake Bomb. Cool. Thank you very much for playing this Dragon Man Reunited demo. For more information, credits, blah, please check the readme. I hope to see you all at the full release later this year. Oh. Okay, later this year. I did not expect that. Okay, wait. So what happens if we try to reload the file? Oh, okay, we still can. Okay, well, we gotta buy this before we leave. Alright. And, uh, none of the other stages are playable. I think that about wraps it up. Not sure if hard mode does anything at this point in time. Extra boss attacks and harder levels? Hmm. Maybe something to test out in the full product. Well, that was Dragon Main Reunited. I'll leave you guys with that for now. Very, very cool demo. Um, there are some areas to be improved, as with anything anyone makes, but overall, it was a strong uh, demo for Sage 2022. Good job, Baby Jeff, uh, Nuclear, and everyone else that worked on this. Um, it was pretty cool. Yeah, I... Just, uh, if you want to hear feedback, just listen through that hour of footage, but I have high hopes for this to show up later this year, apparently. Looking forward to that. Alright, see you guys later. This is Zeno, signing off. Thanks for watching.